Let us consider how we may spur one another on toward love and good deeds. Another way, another translation of this is let's think of ways to encourage one another, meaning let's be active in this. Let's not be passive, but let's think of ways uh, that we can encourage one another in our relationships. He continues in verse 25. He says this, not giving up meeting together as some are in the habit of doing. Here's what I love about this. It's really kind of hard to explain, but there is something incredible, mysterious, There is something powerful that happens when followers of Jesus come together and meet face to face. There is something powerful that happens when followers of Jesus come together and they they share life with one another. They open up about life with one another. They do life together. They pray with one another. They pray for one another. They come and they meet together. There is something powerful that happens that you just cannot experience all by yourself alone. There's something powerful that happens that you cannot experience in front of, you know, a computer screen or in front of your phone. And what the author of Hebrews is telling us is, look, you need to practice the power of presence. And what I love about this is that the author of Hebrews, he's telling Christ followers 2,000 years ago that they need to practice the power of presence. So it's still the same thing today. We need to be reminded of the importance of practicing the power of presence of presence. Don't settle by living your life in front of a screen. Don't miss out on the power of being with people. As a church, we love technology. We love social media, and we want to leverage technology and social media for the sake of making more and better followers of Jesus. In fact, some of you right now, you're watching um, our online stream, and maybe you're sitting in bed right now in your PJs. Maybe you're in your family room, or maybe you're away on vacation in a hotel, and you want to keep track with what's going on here on Sundays at Northridge. Um, We love that. That's an incredible benefit of technology, but that should never replace you coming together and meeting at one of our campuses. Why? Because presence is powerful. 